real besties? Or was Meghan blowing smoke? Serena Williams served up some truth on the matter. Serena Williams has shocked the world by deciding to step away from tennis, saying she has reached a crossroads in her life. She opened up about her decision to Vogue, saying, "'I'm not ready for it to be over, but I'm ready for what's next.'" The tennis titan also talked about her friends and family taking priority over her tennis career. It's hard to imagine Williams not dominating the tennis court, but she wants her next chapter to be about balancing the relationships with those she cares about. One relationship that has caught the public's eye is Williams' friendship with Meghan Markle, Duchess of Sussex. According to Insider, the two have been friends since 2014. However, a tell-all biography claimed that Markle had thrown the word friend around haphazardly, claiming that Williams didn't see the former actress as a close pal. Williams recently addressed those claims head-on, setting the record straight about her relationship with Markle. When Williams sat down with Vogue to break down 22 of her most iconic fashion looks, she sent a message that her friendship with Markle is as strong as ever. Vogue presented the tennis star with a picture of her in a pink Versace dress at Markle and Prince Harry's wedding in 2018. Love this image. This is at the royal wedding when my friend Meghan married Harry. The queen of tennis doesn't seem bothered by the rumors questioning the legitimacy of her friendship with Markle. In a blog Markle posted on her now-defunct website, the royal wrote that she and Williams became friends quickly in 2014 at DirecTV Celebrity Beach Bowl. She explained, "...we hit it off immediately, taking pictures, laughing through the flag football game we were both playing in, and chatting not about tennis or acting, but about all the good old-fashioned girly stuff. So began our friendship." Williams and Markle regularly support each other. The Duchess of Sussex has supported Williams by attending her games at Wimbledon and also promoting her business. Back in 2018, Williams launched her fashion line. Williams stated, "...I knew I had two loves, tennis and fashion, and had to find a way to make them coexist." Soon after the launch, Williams began dressing her friend, which naturally garnered a good amount of attention for her brand. After all, Markle has a history of impacting sales greatly after wearing pieces from different designers. Those items often sell out fast. For Williams, she says it's all been exciting to dress a royal. She explained to Business of Fashion, "...it's so fun because people are like, oh my god, like wow, the quality is crazy. Listen, if we're giving our stuff to Meghan, it has to be the highest quality that we can get. So that's what I tell our team internally. We have to make sure it's super high quality that, you know, is fit for a royal princess." Though Williams and Markle have enjoyed many fun times, their friendship goes deeper. Williams stepped up for her friend when the press came down hard on Markle, after she and her husband sat down for a bombshell interview with Oprah Winfrey. In the televised chat that had a global reach of 50 million, Markle confided to Winfrey that a royal member disparagingly commented on the skin color of her and Prince Harry's unborn child and discussed how dark the complexion might be. And you're not going to tell me who had the conversation? I think that would be very damaging to them. Though both the Duke and Duchess of Sussex chose to keep the identity of the royal in question hidden, the revelations sparked outrage. Many believe they should have kept that information private. Like a true friend, Williams defended Markle, posting a tribute to her pal on Instagram. She wrote, "...Markle, my selfless friend, lives her life and leads by example, with empathy and compassion. She teaches me every day what it means to be truly noble. Her words illustrate the pain and cruelty she's experienced." 